I love that intro. What is up, YouTube? This is Lizard Style Retro Lizard coming at you with another mod. Uh, today, I have for you a Mortal Kombat 2 Arcade 1-Up mod. This one is a standard mod. It's running the Pi 3 image. Uh, 128 gigabyte image that it's running on a Pi 3 Model B+. Plus. Um, this has your standard 8, 000, almost 9,000 games on it. Uh, we have red and yellow buttons is what the customer chose. Uh, these were the buttons that we were able to find at this time. Amazon is starting to run scarce with options. You know, with every mod, we have our speaker upgrade on it too. So we have our fris we have speaker upgrade in the back, which we drilled the holes right there and the speakers go down there. And of course we have our new power switch that's wired into a power strip that you can see lit up in there. So, of course, we're coming to you from our garage again, too. This mod, let's go over to Mortal Kombat games. These are all the Mortal Kombat games that are on here. There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one. Twenty one Mortal Kombat games on here. We have Mortal Kombat 1 through Ultimate for the arcade, all the way up through PlayStation 1 for Mortal Kombat Trilogy. You have your SNES versions, your Game Boy versions, your Sega versions, and your Sega Master System versions too. So personally, my favorite is Ultimate Mortal Kombat 3. That's one of the best ones I think it is. So also on here too, people ask a lot of questions. We have plenty of Simpsons games on here. Ninja Turtle games. Zelda games. Plenty of Pac-Man. Metroid, a couple of those. Metal Slug, oh, these games are so good. Mega Man games, those are a lot. Mario section, look at all the Mario games there are. Looney Tunes, Final Fantasy, plenty of Donkey Kongs. Castlevanias, your beat em up category. There are a few in here too. That's not bad. So let's go into Mortal Kombat. So the way we set this up is that these buttons correspond for what's on the board. So let's go down to Ultimate Mortal Kombat 3. While this is loading up too, as you can see on the board, you have high punch, low punch, high kick, low kick, block, and your run button. Same thing corresponds on the other side too. Your select buttons are your coin buttons on this machine and your start is your player starts. Doo -doo -doo. So here we go. High punch, low punch, high kick, low kick, block, and run. Same thing for the other side. Yeah. High punch, low punch, high kick, low kick, block, and then run. There you go. And then the same way to get out of a game, you press your start and select on your player one. Boom. That'll get you out of the game. So that's pretty much it for this mod. This is your standard mod, like I said. It's got the last plate on it. It has the arcade games. You know, these, there's just so many arcade games on here. They're all alphabetical order. As you can see, it starts scrolling and it starts going. If you go back, it'll tell you possibly in the corner you have for arcade games, oops, this is 1,075 arcade games. That's how many come on here. That's just arcade games. You have your MAME games, Stanley, you're on here. For MAME, there are 603 
MAME games. That's separate from the arcade games. You got your Final Burn Alpha, your Neo Geos, which has your Metal Slugs in it, your Fatal Furies, things like that. Your Daphne games, your Space Ace, your Dragon's Lair, your Vetrix systems, your Atari systems, Atari 5200, 7800, Lynx. I mean, it's got all the standard stuff that we put on here. So the Nintendo games, this is the full Nintendo library that come on these systems. A lot of people ask these questions too. How many games are on it? What games are on it? There's so many games on it that it is hard to have a master list. So scrolling through is just a better way to do it. So your Japanese versions of the Nintendo systems, your Famicom systems, you know, this has, oh, this doesn't have it. Where is it? Is it this one? It was this one that had Holy Diver. Maybe I'm looking at a different system that had Holy Diver. Um, or Sega. Super Nintendo. Full Super Nintendo library, man. Alien vs. Predator, plus the arcade games on this one, too. Your Batman games. I mean, there's just so many. Let's see how many we got. We have... Bottom right, that says 787 Super Nintendo games. Sega Genesis, we have 701 Sega Genesis games. That's pretty much the full library. 32X, you got 33 32X games, and that also includes Mortal Kombat for the 32X. Sega CD. Mortal Kombat isn't on this one, but that's okay. You still got your Slipheed, your Snatcher, your Sonic CD, your Jurassic Park, uh, Heart of the Alien. Uh, Pop Full Mail's on here too. This is one of the most rarest Sega CD games to have. This game's worth at least 150 bucks. It's on here, it's included. Same thing with the Earthworm Jim Sega CD version. It's on here. This also is worth 150 bucks. So the system just has so much stuff. So again, thanks for watching my videos. Turn the machine off, hit the start button, put on quit, shut down, really shut down, yes. Wait for the no video on the screen, no signal. There you go. Come over to the back. Flip the switch. And then you're all shut off. That's it. Thanks for watching, guys.